Hi, everyone. Uh, so for my example, what I chose for my phenomenon is um, how celebrities are treated differently and asked different questions and interviews based off their gender. Uh, for my two celebrities, I chose Jack Harlow and uh, Doja Cat. Um, Jack Harlow is a straight man, a straight male, and Doja Cat is a bisexual woman. Um, these are super, super extremely well-known artists in the music industry, all over social media. Um, they're just super cool people all around. Um, I watched a lot of interviews with Jack Carlo, and a lot of the interviews, um, he was asked a lot of things based off, let's say, like, you know, his best pickup lines, how he picks up women or partners, um, things like dating advice, you know, what's the trick and things like that. And then I was looking at the ones for Doja Cat, and I noticed that all these same, like, all these companies that are like these big, big um, for social media and, and media companies, they were asking these questions in interviews that were more along the lines of like, you know, what's her favorite TikTok dance? What's her top three emojis that she likes to use of all time? Um, if she had to get a tattoo, like what would it be? Um, her favorite music. And it was things like, they were kind of the complete opposite of what they're asking Jack Harlow. And I did some digging and digging and digging. And I couldn't really find too much. And it really, really seems like a lot of these media companies are avoiding asking, you know, a Doja Cat, this, the same questions that they're asking Jack Carlo. It seems like for some reason, there's just like, there's not much to find about it. There's nothing really out there. And it's kind of seems like they're avoiding asking that, which is kind of, it's, it's putting that, that separation of like how they're kind of not really treating her equally in a way. It's like, you know, like they can ask her these exact same questions after asking Jack Carlo, but it kind of seems like what they're doing is not really asking that because they don't really want to, I guess, I guess that they don't want to know that. Um, it seems like they're just really, really stepping away from asking those questions and asking more of like these calmer, more questions that are along the borderline. I'm just like very simple versus as Jack Carlo, you know, it's very straightforward, very like, you know, how you picking up women, how you hooking up with people and things like that. So it kind of just seems like they're just really avoiding it.